Impact Wrestling fans, what's going on? BQ with the Impact Lounge. It is the morning. For me, it's about 6 a.m. right now as I speak to you. I would have loved to have been on the road for WrestleCon already. But last night I was coming home um, from hanging out with my kids and realized my headlights were out. So I had to drive about an hour with my brights on. Pissed off a lot of people. So now I have to wait for the sun to come up and get my headlights fixed. Um... So it's throwing a little damper in the plans. Wanted to get there a lot earlier today, but it's uh, it's whatever. I'm not sure what to expect when I get there. And never been to WrestleCon. I was chatting with Sienna not too long ago, and she said WrestleCon is a complete clusterfuck, and she usually doesn't do it. So I'm trying to figure out. Uh, you know, obviously I'm there for the Impact and Lucha show, but uh, trying to see what else I can catch. You know, during the day and all that. I'm trying to find the where all the wrestlers are at, like doing the signings and everything. So Taryn Terrell is the one I'm trying to track down. I have her schedule. I just have no idea where the F she's going to be. So I'm really learning with all this. But most of you already know this. They announced, which I would imagine would be the last match of the show so far. Um, I mean, not last last match like the main event, but the last match that they're announcing, which is going to be Eli Drake versus Brian Cage. So yesterday they, they announced the final four matches. And um, in the previous video that I did, I had assumed Eli Drake was going to take on Mil Muertes. That is not the case. It's going to be the mo machine. I was going to say the monster, the machine, Brian Cage. These guys have a long history together, came up as a tag team, the natural selection under Percy Pringle. So I would imagine in real life, they're pretty good friends, should put on a good show. And uh, I'm curious to see who goes over. I would imagine it's going to be Brian Cage, but I would hate to see Eli Drake lose the match. So this is the one match of the evening I wouldn't mind some kind of dirty finish or non-finish. Because I'd imagine these guys are going to mix it up on impact at some point. But I hope it's down the road. I hope it's not anytime soon. Neither of these guys need the loss in that case. So yes, good stuff. This should be a great card. I cannot wait for it. And keep an eye out for my review on the show when I get back because I am going to post all the pictures during, um, in a, you know, more of a slideshow format during the video when I upload it to YouTube. And you do not want to miss that. I've got a great second row seat, about three seats down from the entrance. So I should get some really good pictures. And I can't wait. And I just need the sun to come up so I can get on the road. I, lo I love leaving early for road trips. Like if I could have been on the road at 4 or 5 a.m., I would have loved it. Um, but it's going to be later. Blech. Talk to you guys soon. Peace.